The Istanbul Film Festival has seen nearly two dozen movie makers and a group of international critics pull out because of a censorship row. The government has blocked the screening of a film about Kurdish militants, citing paperwork issues. The festival competition has been called off. We are asking uh, the freedom of showing the films that we are selecting in the, our programme uh, without requiring any documents within, within the context of festivals and cultural activities, which is happening like everywhere else in the world. If a film doesn't get that uh, document, what happens then? The film is censored in that sense. The barred film, North, documents the lives of militants from the outlawed Kurdistan Workers' Party, or PKK. The government says PKK propaganda has no place in a democratic society. Cinemas have to be open to the public, he says. I mean, you buy your ticket and watch the film, and after, you say what you think about it. You shouldn't be afraid of that. This is not helping the peace process. The cinema industry says the blocking of North is the latest example of censorship in Turkey. The country's frequent crackdowns on political expression, critical of the government's position, have alarmed activists. Our reporter says the result of this political intervention is that the most important Turkish film festival will not have an award nor a closing ceremony. It may also make already difficult relations between Turkey and Kurds even worse.